guys welcome to my channel Zekro so today I'm gonna show you guys how to patch your Digimon story loss evolution from Japanese to English sub translation so if you guys didn't know on the 1st January there's a uh, some group of translation translation that doing this great job so without further ado let's go so first what you're gonna do is you have to download this Nintendo DS emulator so if you have window version you need to download uh, this link and if you have a MacBooks so you're gonna do this download this link so we're gonna download this link first okay then the first steps is done next you guys have to go to this page I will put the link below so what you guys gonna do is to download this file so operation decode Digimon game fan translation they have been doing a great job and finally they have done to translate everything into English sub then we just have to download from this mega okay so we done this two step after done the download so for my I put all what I download to the download device location <coughs> so for this to be work you need to have three things once the emulator once the patch and what is the best game of Digimon story loss evolution so you need to create your own dumb so what we're gonna do first we have to create a folder so let's say I put Digimon story loss evolution English sub so then you go to the patch folder you need to copy this file and put inside the folder that we done just now then you have to copy the base game and put also in the folder okay then lastly we open this delta patch so you click open and you go to the this file that we create just now choose the delta file and then on the same file you choose the game base and then for the output so make sure it's in the same folder also so let's say we name it Digimon story loss evolution English okay then for this to be work you need to put dot and ds then just save it and patch okay so it stated here file patched successfully then just close this and then we already download the emulator so just click here so you get this the emulator choose file open room and go to the just now the folder that we create is this one so you can see here we have got two type of file which is this is the first version the Japanese translation and this is the English sub translation so we just gonna click here and voila it's running so let's see and test the game
That's it guy it works perfectly for the game so for to know that whether the English translation work or not alright that's it the menu is in English okay guys thank you for watching bye